everyone and welcome to Phase Phonics Day 12 with Miss Burnett. Let's start by recapping sounds that we already know. Let's look at the first one. Ear. Ow. Or. A. E. I. Your Oi Ooh Uh You Now let's read some words using those sounds that we just revisited. Have a go at reading this one by yourself. Well done. It says the word smart. You are all so smart. Let's have a go at reading this one together. Groan. Groan. My granddad likes to groan about everything. Have a go at reading this one. Well done. Brush. I like to brush my hair every morning. So have a go at reading this one. Well done. Growl. I can hear my dog growling. Let's read this one together. Scoop. Scoop. I'd like three scoops of ice cream, please. So today we are going to learn a new sound. Our new sound today is you. You. Now you might think, Miss Finnett, we learnt this sound the other day, which we did, but we looked at spelling it like this. You. But today we're going to learn a different way of spelling it. And it looks like this. We looked at this diagraph yesterday, didn't we? You're right, and it made the ooh sound. But today, it makes the you sound. So let's practice reading some words using our sound you. Let's have a go at reading the first one together. St, you, stew. I had beef stew for dinner. Stew. Have a go at reading this one. Well done. Few. There are few children at school today. Few. Let's have a go at reading this one. N you. New. I have new nails today. New. Have a go at reading this one by yourself. See if you can identify the different graphing that's in there. Off you go. Well done. N -e -f -u. Nephew. I have one nephew called Jack. Have a go at this one. Well done. Dew. There is dew on the ground today. Dew. Let's look at our tricky today. Our tricky word is Mrs. Mrs. So we sound out the m, but we don't sound out the r. And then we can hear the s, Mrs. Mrs. Jew likes to go outside. Have a go now at reading this sentence. Pause the screen and read it by yourself. Off you go. Welcome back. Let's have a go at reading it together. Mrs. Jew had a b beef, beef, st you, stew with her n f u. Nephew. Mrs. Jew had a beef stew with her nephew. How nice. Okay, what I'd like you to do now is pause the screen in a moment and find all the U sounds today. Off you go. Welcome back. I'm going to circle all the U sounds now and see if you got them all right. There's one here. One here. Here and here. Well done if you got them all right, and well done if you could identify all the different sounds surrounding the U sound. Excellent, well done. On the screen here, we have some pictures. What I'd like you to do is read all the words, find the words that have a U sound in them. So, for example, n, U. Using that word new, 
can you write me a sentence using that word? Pause the screen now and have a go with all the U words. I want you to see if you can write me a sentence. Off you go. How did you do? I'm sure you did really well. Well done, everyone. So let's read through these words now. Skirt. Does that have the U sound? No, it doesn't. Crayon. Not there. Donkey. No. Nope. Dew. Well done. Pew. Well done. Stew. Yes. And shine. Not there. Well done if you got them all right and well done for writing those sentences. Excellent work. Let's have a go now at writing some words using our new sound, you. The first word I'd like you to write is n you. New. Off you go. Write the word new. Welcome back. Let's have a go now at writing it together. New. Well done. The next word I'd like you to write is the word nephew. N -e -f -u. Nephew. Off you go. See if you can write it by yourself. Let's have a go at writing it together now. N -e -f -u. Remember PH, that's the diagraph we're using today. U. And our new diagraph today, nephew. Well done if you got that right. Fantastic writing. Now let's try writing our tricky word today, which is Mrs. Mrs. Pause the screen now and write the word Mrs. Off you go. Let's see if you got it right. So we know that we sound our m, but we have an r in the middle here and an s. Mrs. Well done. Excellent work today, everyone. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you soon.